We just finished our new widget called Agents Carousel. So with this widget, you can show the contact information in social media of your agents. Before we created this app, the only way to showcase your agents on IDX Broker was through an agents page. But right now it's possible to create a widget and just add it wherever on your site. So to access this app, you go to idxannels.com and on agents carousel. When you go on here, you will see the name of all of the agents linked to your account. So you will see their agent ID, their name, email, and phone number. What you want to do is you want to update their social media because this is how the widget would look. It will say meet the staff and then you will see your agents along with their name, their email, phone number, and then at the bottom it has some social media icons. So in this case it has Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, so that when somebody clicks on that it will take them to the social media of that agent. You can also decide not to add social media accounts, but it's an option that the Agents Carousel widget gives. Um, it also gives the option to click on full profile to see the complete agent's profile. So um, if you want to edit the social media of this agent, for example, you would click on edit, and then you would just add in here the URL. For example, if you want to add a Twitter account, let's use this one, for example, it takes you to Bill Gates, you would copy this paste it here and click on update social media. And it will now show up here and you will do the same thing for all the social media accounts. I will remove it for now, just so that it doesn't show that on the client site. You will do the same thing for all of the agents that you want to show on your widget. This is very important because the widget will only show the agents that have some social media. If you don't want to add a social media account, you can add a number sign or any sign just so that the system registers that you have something there. For example, this ones that don't have any social media will not be showing up on your widget. So if you want this agent to show up, you have to add something there. It can either be a number sign so that it's blank and that the agent shows up, or it can actually be a Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, or LinkedIn URL. You can also leave some of them blank. You have all of your agents here, so make sure you go through all of the ones that you have available and update the ones that you want to show on your widget. You can also make a maximum of 100 entries show up here, but you would still have more pages here if you have more agents. The next thing you want to do is to choose which are your filter options. You can choose either state, city, or zip code. So if you choose the city option, for example, and then you choose Atlanta, it will only show the agents that work in Atlanta and that have a social media. So let's choose city, Atlanta, and we can call this meet the staff as it is on the demo, or we can just call it meet our agents. All you have to do next is to click on copy code. And as you can see, only agents that meet the following characteristics will be displayed, city, Atlanta. So only agents working in Atlanta and that have social media will show up. So let's test it out here on JS Fiddle. I'll paste it in the HTML section and make this small just so that we can see the result here. And this is how it will look. Meet out agents, looks like I made a mistake. Let me fix that and copy the code again. There it is. So as you can see, Amy Minter has social media here. Haley Hirsch, same thing. And the same thing applies for the six agents that are showing up here. Wade Morris. Here it is. So these are the agents that are in Atlanta for the account that I'm using, Southern Classic Realtors, and that have a social media account. Let me show you how this looks on an agent's page. So this is Southern Classic Realtors, and we added the agent widget for them here at the top of this map page. So you can scroll through the agents using these circles at the bottom, and you can click on this agent, for example, and it will take you to their full profile with the agent listings that they manage. And you would also, if they have a Facebook or an Instagram or a LinkedIn 
um, add it into their profile, you would click on Facebook and it would take you there. As you remember, we added a number sign. So in this case, it's not active. You can also get to their profile page by clicking on full profile. So this is a very useful way to showcase the agents that you manage, and you can also filter them. So if you have a page dedicated to properties in Atlanta, you can add only Atlanta agents. And if you have another page of properties in Savannah, Georgia, for example, you can make another agent widget with only agents that work in Savannah. You can get the agents carousel for free by making Realty Candy your developer partner. It is fast, free, and easy. All you have to do is to have an IDX broker account and email them saying you want us to be your developer partner.